So March Hack Sprint uh, kicks off this weekend, the 27th. Um, so I participated last time for Money Socket. I'm going to do it again. Um, so the project last time was uh, the Costanza wallet. We got started on this. But yeah, since then, it's been more or less finished to vision. I mean, there's more work that could be done, but that's not the, the priority right now. Also, since last hack sprint, uh, we built this custodial portal. Um, so it's a way, uh, rather than running the full node stack yourself, which you still can, but if you want a quick connection, something to connect your wallet to, uh, you can create an account here, create a connection, connect the wallet to it, and fund your account, and you can be uh, you know, using the spending wallet over a money socket. So that's the basis that we're starting off of. So now that we have the wallet and the custodial backend, the one thing we're missing is a simple application to actually connect the wallet to uh, and start spending some sats over a money socket that'll really show off uh, kind of the power of the protocol. So that's what I want to build for this Hack Sprint project is just a basic chat application that uh, works works with money socket. So I have this mocked up. This is uh, just a very you know, a couple of hours work to kind of get a basic web socket chat going. So you can, so it echoes, connects to the WebSocket server down here and echoes the message through. So what I want this to be is like a paid chat. So you'd have, you'd, you'd tether your money socket wallet to this and the chat messages will only go through if you pay an invoice that the server provides. So I drew just a quick diagram of what that looks like. So it's the server that's uh, accepting connections from the client. So the client types a chat message, goes to the server, the server uh, requests an invoice. So it has a money socket connection to some account on a terminus somewhere. So it provides the invoice and the invoice is sent back up to the client. Now, if there's no money socket connection, perhaps I could just display the Bolt 11 and you could pay. But the idea is that this guy would also be tethered to a wallet such that that invoice can just immediately be forwarded down to um, the wallet, which would then forward it uh, to whatever backing terminus. So the invoice would get paid over the Lightning Network and then when that pre-image is available here, that gets set up to the server. And then the server's job is then to relay that message in, in exchange for, for those sats. So I'll be available during the hack sprint time working on this. Uh, happy to talk with anybody about anything, money socket or otherwise. Um, so yeah, see you there.